Hello world, my name's Timster, and welcome back to Digimon World 2. Where we left off was... We did stuff. That's all I got. <laughs> uh, we did unlock the archive port, which supposedly is where Ben Oldman would be. So, let's jump right in, see where, uh, what he's up to, what he's doing. Who is he? Who are you, fat man? Aren't you Ben Oldman? I'm Timmy, a Digital City Guard Tamer. I heard about you from Professor Piotti. I need to know where the Archive ship is. Do you know? What? Piotti? You want to know about the Archive ship? Oh yeah, I already gave someone that voice. <clears throat> uh, who are you? I can't tell the ancient secret to someone I don't even know. Please, I have to find out where it is. The Blood Knights are after the same information. Your life is in danger. <laughs> Talk. Talk is cheap. It's like my mom. She was... I'm not going there. <laughs> if you really want to know the secret, show me your power. Then I'll decide if you're worthy. I'll be waiting for you at DVD Domain. What's a DVD? What's a paladin? The place is in this message. Now go on. Get! What? Wait. It's important. Please. We got message two. I don't even remember what message one was. But there you have it. We ran into what I think is Ben Oldman. Now we go to DVD domain, and if memory serves, it's only one single floor, but Ben Oldman is no pushover. Make sure your Digimon are ready, make sure you have the items you need, and just make sure you're prepared for a somewhat tough fight. At least that's what I remember from back in the day. It was a tough fight for me, and I lost in the first round. Granted, there is only one round, but you know what I mean. <laughs> so, like I said, I'm going to make sure I'm prepared, and we'll be right back. And we made it to the boss floor! <laughs> yeah, like I said, there's only one floor, so no exploration, no new Digimon, no nothing. If we continue upward, we should find Ben Oldman himself. Okay, one more room. There we go. <laughs> oh, his is brown, he's got two cannons! That's fancier than my beetle! You came after all? I thought you might be too scared. I guess there are still some kids with guts these days. I may be young, but I'm not a coward. I see. Then show me that you're not just all talk. If you beat me, uh... Oh, sorry. <clears throat> if you beat me, I'll apologize for insulting you. Oh, we are gonna beat him so hard his mother won't recognize him. And he had... I'm sorry, I, I thought Ben Oldman was, you know, a legend. I thought he'd have better Digimon than this. Since Harumon and Marumon will go down with ease, Metal Bambamon... I'm only worried about his counterattack, but not that worried. Alright, so let's go ahead and Lightning Blast. We'll probably take out the champions first, just to get them out of the way. I'm more concerned with Marumon, because I think he's a bit stronger than Sitarumon. We'll do Hornbuster and... Finish off Miramon with a Flower Cannon. He's not going to go down with those two, but at the very least, I can weaken his power. Flower power. Only 49. Miramon is data, so Lilymon didn't counterattack. What? Oh. Right. He's an actual tamer, so he DNA Digivolved his Digimon. I forgot. And 51, not horrible. I bet he's like halfway dead. Right, because we're my counter attack. I can't interrupt him. That's really lame how they set that up. I should be able to interrupt counter attacks, no problem. We'll interrupt uh, Sitarumon. Lower tech power, so we only 35 damage. Holy crap. This might not go so well. But, 4 damage, I'll take it. Here comes his Mammothmon. Boom. Only 33 damage. Compared to my 50 or so. Then again, I don't know. <laughs> Alright, I think we're going to stop fooling around. All out assault on Miramon. Because why not? Am I might close enough? I don't even know. Do some good damage. Boom. 49. 
really liking Lilymon. I'm glad I'm training her. Here come the blaster. 40. Again, I probably have a really odd type advantage. I have no viruses, two vaccines, and one data. But overall, we're not doing too bad. Now he uses Fireball. At 22 damage, that's not horrible. I have to admit. Hyper Heat, what? That was weak. And attack miss. <laughs> oh, it's perfect. Okay. I think Lilymon's gonna finish off Miramon. The other two will take on Centaurumon. Come on, do me proud! Oh, excuse me, I don't know where that came from. That should end you. And it did! Nice! Come on, Blue Thunder! 51, not horrible. Are you gonna counter? No counters, good. 40. Again, I know it's a type of advantage, but it really hurts to see Metal Greymon doing such weak damage. I'll take the 12, though. Do not care for that 29, but it I'm not doing horrible. I gotta keep that in mind. So far, so good. They're one Digimon down, almost two. No... Attack missed? What? <clears throat> yeah, Lily Mom, just show him how it's done. <laughs> She's like the only one I can rely on on my team right now. Forty, okay. Still in there, regretfully. Seventeen on Lily Mon. And what are you going to do? 20... Wow, they hate for Lilymon. Why? I know she's awesome, but no need to hate her. Uh... It's difficult for me to choose. Let's do Dark Side Attack, just as a bit of a change-up. And the others will focus on Metal Mammon. Centaur Mon will probably not go down. But at the very least, this might do enough damage. At least I'm hoping he'll do enough damage. 47 from Lilymon. He's gonna come in for the counter attack. Because Energy Bomb and Smiley Bomb are both counters, of course. But it's okay, we're still good. Everything's still good. Come on, Ranger Mon! Boom! 42. And he's still in there! I should have used Blue Thunder. It's okay, though. I mean, Metal Greymon is not the best option for this battle, because he's not doing that great damage. But I would rather battle with three ultimates than kind of cheat the system with three Megas. Okay, if we do... If we do Meteor Wing, it'll do okay damage. Yeah, I'll do Meteor Wing. I don't really have a choice at this point. And we'll just focus on Metal Man 1. At the very least, all three of them will focus on Metal... Well, not focus, but... All three will deal damage to Metal Mammon, and he's the bigger threat of all the three. I just wanted to save him for last because of his counterattacks. Granted, it might have been better to take him out first and foremost, but if I did, they would all be weakened because of Energetic Bomb, and the other two would have taken him out easily. Here comes the Meteor Wing, and the counterattack is taken care of. Oh, that wasn't even enough to kill him! Oh, my strategies are fail! And here comes his Hyper Heat. It's okay, though. We're still okay. I don't even need to heal. I'm gonna have to use another Meteor Wing. But that's all I've got. I mean, not really all I've got. But at the very least, this should finish off Centaurumon. I should've just used Blue Thunder last round and forgot about having everyone attack Metal Mammon, but I had to take a risk hoping it would work. It didn't pay out. And his attack missed! Nice! Metal, 
That should have done it. Stay down. Yes! Now we can focus an all-out assault on Metal Mamibon, and this battle is won. Alright, let's see here. Be with Thunder. I'm gonna use Horn... No, because if he counterattacks, there's no way to do it. I'm gonna use Pretty Attack, though, especially if he lives. Let's go. Attack! Do some good damage. 47, not bad. You know, I wonder if I could use some kind of cannon or, uh... Yeah, one of my cannons to weaken him or something. Ooh, that 41, that hurt. You know, I really wish they called it Blue Thunder instead of Lightning Blast. That sounds so much cooler. And I'm not going to use that attack anymore. That was... Every time I use... I forgot what it was even called. Yeah, every time I use Pretty Attack, it never works. It always misses. I don't know if it... You wait, I don't know if it wastes my MP or not, but... So far, it's always missed. So I'm not going to use it ever again. That is just a waste of time. But this... Final assault should be the end of Battle Mammon. Are you gonna stay down? No. He's gonna counterattack. This is gonna hurt. 50. But it's okay. Ranger Mind will finish it. And game! Right? Yes! Beat him! Ah, uh, that. I think I remember why it was, so, it was so tough. I didn't expect the other two to have other attacks. And I think I went after Metal Mammon first because he's the ultimate. Which made him counterattack me over and over again until my Digimon were weakened enough for Centaurumon. And I forgot the other, other, other Digimon already, but it weakened me enough for those other two to finish me off. I think that's what made it really tough. So leave Metal Mammon for last, have a good type of advantage against him, and you're good. And we beat you, old man! Yeah. Wow, you beat me, kid. You're not bad. Hey, kid, what's your name again? My name's Timmy. I see, Timmy. I apologize for insulting you before. I'm sorry, I guess I got a bit carried away. It's the competitive nature in me. I apologize for insulting you. I'll tell you what I want to... I'll tell you what you want to know at Archive 4. I'll be there waiting for you. Timmy, I'll be watching you mature. Don't watch me at all, creepy! I don't like you. But I'm gonna go to your port. I mean, your archive port. I mean, your, this, where the ship is. Yeah. Ah, this is bad. Okay, so now that we beat Ben Oldman at his own game, let's return to the archive port and see what he has to tell us. And... This actually looks a lot like Device Dome. Weird. Let's go in here for a second. I'm sure Ben Oldman won't mind. Whoa. What is this now? I mean, I know what it is, but I'm just raising the serious suspicions for people at home. So many computers, though. Is this the Enterprise? Are we on the Starship Enterprise? Cool. Call me Jean-Luc Picard. I lost to a kid like you, but I prom but a promise is a promise. So you want to know where the Archive ship is? Well, you already know it. The Archive ship is a huge turtle Digimon, and it's in the big junk pile. By now, the ship is all messed up, and it's just a big junk bucket. This is the Archive ship? I would have never guessed it. But why are the Blood Knights looking for something like this? Even I don't have an answer for that. But it has our... But it has our... <laughs> wow! Great great job! Translation issues! Perfect! But it has so many old items. There may be something that's useful in it. it Calls the security guards from the city to come here and guard this place. It would be better to have someone here. They may come in handy. Oh yes! You guys are looking for Crimson, right? Take this! This is data on a domain he discovered when he was still a guard team. He may be hiding out there. Take it and have the guard team study it. Thank you so much, Mr. Oldman. 
Yeah, thanks for being useful. Alright, now that we got the... What? <laughs> I haven't been saluted for a long time. It reminds me of when I used to be the Blue Falcon leader. Now go on and study the... Just say, go on and study the Blood Knights. Hurry up and go. Get off my lawn. <laughs> Alright, so... There you go. That's how you beat Ben Oldman. And that's how you find the Archive ship. Which is actually in the Archive port. Our next destination is talk to the Blue Falcon leader, so I'll meet you guys there. Alright, let's see what Cecilia has to say to us. Blue Falcon leader, I found Ben Oldman. Great, good job, wonderful, yay. We already knew that. What? Nothing, nothing. So did he know anything about the Archive ship? Well, actually, he's living in the Archive ship. But the Archive ship broke down a long time ago, and it doesn't work at all. I see. The Archive ship is not usable. We'll send some guard tamers to the Archive ship. Oh yeah, Ben Oldman gave this to me. This is supposed to be a map of a domain that Crimson found a long time ago. Crimson may be hiding there. We will calculate the exact location using that map and the latest geo geographical data. We'll f we will finally be facing the Blood Knights at last! That's right! You have a new mission! Timmy, go out to Code Domain and destroy the Blood Knights! Yes, ma'am! I will come back empty-handed! We'll be coming back empty-handed... many times, probably. Cool, and there's no one to stop us! Usually, whenever a big event thing like that happens, someone's right here to talk to us either... be either Bertrand, Joy Joy, Lewis... You never know. Let's check out the item vendor, see if they have any new stuff. And they don't. At... Ooh, excuse me, where'd that come from? I have no idea. Okay, so as far as I can tell, Device Dome does have some new items, some new weapons, or some new missiles for your Digi Beetle, as well as a new set of tires for Blue Swamps. But I can't tell if there are any new parts for Digi Beetle. The reason I'm saying all this Make sure you're prepared for the next domain. It's one that is not similar. Well, basically, the next domain is going to be a little bit more tougher than usual. I forgot how many floors, but there's going to be plenty of traps, plenty of dead ends. You know, just make sure your Digimon are in top gear before you end up going right into that just to be ejected right back out to Digital City, because you ran out of EP, ran out of HP, or whatever. Once you feel like you're prepared, jump right into Code Domain. And as you might be hearing, the music changed drastically. We got Angemon and Clear Agumon. We're just gonna avoid them, because... I'm pretty sure that chirping you hear might be part of the music. Yeah, it's gotta be. <laughs> The music's changed because this is going to be one tough domain. Tougher than any other domain we've fought before. But let's just keep going. We're pretty much just going to make a beeline straight for the last floor. Because th there's nothing... There aren't going to be any new Digimon here we haven't already seen. Until we get closer to the top or the bottom. I don't actually know which direction we're going, but... Once we get to see new Digimon, and we will... We'll probably just cut back to that, but until then, I'll see you guys when we find something new. So here's a Digimon we haven't seen before, Seedramon. I don't recall if we have uh, Mega or Metal Seedramon yet, or if we have any of the Digivolution lines leading into them. But here you go, if you have a rough time getting Seedramon, you can find him right here in Code Domain, usually on the ninth floor. And I gotta say, he's a pretty good Digimon. Ice Blast is not one of the better techniques he could use, but his ultimate and mega form attacks are actually pretty good, so I'd recommend pick him, picking him up, if for no other reason than simply because you could get one of the Dark Masters from him, Metal Sea Drama. And we got another one over there, so yeah, we'll keep going until we get to something new. And we've got another Digimon on our hands! I mean, technically we've already seen Airdramon, we might have seen Dolphmon, and we've definitely seen uh, Pidomon. But we're never in the wild like this before. Airdramon isn't bad. That's basically 
the evolved form of Beomon if you don't give her any DNA ups or anything like that. It's not bad, but it's a disappointment when I didn't get Bergermon. In fact, I was really hoping I would have gotten Bergermon back in the day. I didn't know how to go about it. Beomon didn't become Bergermon, so... Yeah. Uh, this would be a good place to get Ergermon if you don't have her already. She's not entirely bad. Maybe a bit weak for some, but early in the game, she's not bad. We're just gonna keep trucking along. Okay, so we're not on the boss floor yet. But if you look here, we found our first wild ultimate level Digimon, Vedamon. I absolutely despise him because he's so freaky and he has an attack that can confuse your Digimon. Considering mine are on the weaker side, I am not in the mood to fight him right now. It sucks that I lost out on that chest, but, you know, it's not worth the risk. Not when we're so close to the boss floor and I just don't want to fight him. Like, he's not worth it. This guy, on the other hand, actually is worth it. Pixie Mom. Now, on his own, he's not all that bad. He is a data type, so they're pretty mediocre in stats. But that's basically where Magical Tail comes from. When you think of Magnet Angemon that we got from the uh, daycare center, he knows Magical Tail because Pixie Mon, either DNA did evolve with someone who could reach the mega level, or he reached his own mega level and DNA'd with Angemon or something to get... You know what I'm going with this. But that's where you can get Magical Tail from, and he's not a bad Digimon overall, especially the other two that accompany him make him a pretty formidable foe. And as you can see, he actually runs away from you, so if you really want Pixie Mon, you have no better chance than... Yeah, you, it's a pretty good chance for you to get him, no matter what. Provided you stocked up on items prior to this. He keeps running away, so you have a plenty of chances to try to catch him, as long as you have the items. I'm not going to jump ahead, because I believe the next floor is... The Boss Floor. Now, as I said, my Digimon right now are pretty much on the weak side. I have no idea what we're going to expect, but I'm going to go ahead and put my Megas in the front. They're going to be dealing... They're going to be dealing with the Blood Knight soon enough. Now, this is where some of the danger comes in. Because there are traps, mines, bug nests, all that wonderful stuff just scattered all throughout this domain, especially on this floor. So we just got to be careful. And we also don't have an arm strong enough to take care of the purple mines. And we won't be getting that for some time. Which, again, is a pet peeve of mine in this game, because it's like... Why are they throwing all this stuff at you when you can't even remove any of it, when you can't take care of it? You have all crap baskets. Welp, we're going to be fighting Vedamon after all. Isn't this just perfect? Yeah, he's got Octomon, Vedamon, and Gesomon, which aren't bad in and of themselves, but like, one of them can confuse, one of them can poison, one of them could do something else that's not that great, so... Actually, you know what? I'm gonna see if I can run. I would fight him, but I just... am not in the mood for any of his... Any of his trickery. And we still have so much of this domain to explore, and not enough time or... Anything to go through it all. So I'm gonna go down here instead... And see what we got. Looks like a chest, so that works. HP Driver 2, I'll take it. Again, no arm strong enough, and there goes our radar. So now, without a parts fix, we have no idea where we're going, or what room leads to what hallway. We're pretty much driving in the dark here. And I actually don't remember where the boss room is. So it might take me a while. Never mind, I think I found it. <laughs> Might take me a while. Instantly finds it. <laughs> okay, so my Digimon are still in top condition. I don't recall if there's anything else here. Let's move right on in. Ooh. Ah, oh, Damien, no! Ooh! Weren't you the little guard punk I met before? And you're Commander Damien of the Blood Knights, right? Yes! 
I Commander Damien, the big dot of the Blood Knights. Good work on finding this code domain. But your luck has just run out. Because now I'm gonna knock your block off and have you for breakfast. Don't eat my block. Keep talking. I'll take care of you just like the last time. <laughs> what a foolish little kid. I was just playing with you last time. Bring it, Damien. You're not even Damien Wayne. You're not cool. So he's got Edamon, Cherrymon, and Ogremon. Basically, I came in the wrong with the, some of the wrong Digimon. You want nothing but vaccines, I think? And I'll take care of this battle in no time. In which case, I should have switched out for, um... I should have kept War Greymon, but switched in for Metal Greymon and Rangermon, but oh well. Uh, let's go on for the Giga Cannon. Why not? Infernal Missile? Why not? And Terra Force... I'm thinking Edamon because of his attack that makes it so I lose motivation. I cannot have that. I can only hope my Digimon go first. And he does! Nice! This should deal pretty good damage. 122! Nice! Granted, Mega vs. Ultimate, but who's counting? Infernal Bithal! 81! Nice! Nice all around. Why do you deal more damage to Edamon than Ogremon? Or than uh, Cherrymon? That seems a little weird. Counterattack does nothing, bruh. Giga Cannon! I just love how he says Giga Cannon in the anime. Where it's just a nice solid Giga Cannon. And he's gonna keep going until he runs out of MP. But he's targeting Edamon. Yes, perfect! And the nice thing about this attack, it doesn't matter if the Digimon goes down or not. If it goes down, he'll just move on to the next target. Granted, I think his targets are a bit randomized, as you saw there. But if the Digimon's standing, he'll just keep attacking it. If it's down, his attack moves on to the next target. Pit Pelter. Okay, that's a nice attack that targets everyone, but doesn't deal any extra you know, side effects or anything like that. And I can use... I can use one dark sh Wait. Right. I can use one dark shot. Hope it hits something. Infernal Missile. And Terra Force probably on Ogremon just to get him out of the way. We'll knock his block off. Tell ya fourth. Do good damage. As you do. And he's still in there, wow. Let's see what his counterattack will do. Absolutely nothing. But I think there's one counterattack in this game that uses the opponent's MP instead of your own. I'm wondering if that was the attack. I d actually don't remember what Pummel Whack does. So far, so good, though. Cherrymon's still in there. So just one more round and he's finished. See, this is why I love Ward Raymon. His attack is powerful, and with the right type advantage, the opponent stands no chance. Uh, Machine Dramon has to go on guard, unfortunately. But with this, we can just finish this entire battle. I think. Let's see how much damage he'll do against Cherrymon. And... 102, I'll take it. Still hanging in there, as expected. This may or may not finish him, though. It did not. No worries, though. Party time, what? Next round, he'll be finished. Yeah, let's just... Dark shot. Oh, he's low on MP now. And I've still got a few more Terra Forces left in me, so... Warp Raymon, do your thing. Oh, he didn't go first! You know what, I should have used Dual Scissor Claw first and foremost. I didn't even think of that. But whatever, we won! I know, I'm kinda cheating using my Megas that infinitely level up, but... Oh well! 
And that is the end of Damien. Not really. Oh no! This is not possible! I'll let you off this time. I'll let you off for your braveness this time. But next time won't be so easy. Yeah. Get away from me, Damien. What? Wait! Uh, he ran away again. Chicken. Is he really a high-ranking officer of the Blood Knights? Absolutely not. Well, let's bail out of here. I know there's more of this dungeon we could have explored, especially on this floor, but... I don't recall if there's anything too worth it there. There might have been. Oh, welcome back, Timmy. Please check out the right to be The thing is, I didn't get anything from that domain, so I think there was more we should have done. Let's head back to the Blue Falcon leader and see what she says. Timmy, we have an emergency. The Blood Knights attacked Archive Port and Ben Oldman was injured. Great. Mr. Oldman, where are you? What happened? Uh, can anyone tell me what happened? Excuse me, where's Mr. Oldman? He went to the city to see the guard leader. I was just there. What, really? So he's alright then? I'm glad to hear that. Then I'll go back to the city. What was the point of this? I was just in the city. You know what? Hold on. Yeah, we're, um, we're gonna go ahead and save it here. That's really obnoxious. I went to the city to see what's going on. They teleported me back to Archive Port for no reason, only to tell me, Oh, Ben Oldman's in the city, which is exactly where I just was, and they teleported me to the open map. Why? That makes no sense. But you know what? We're not here to make sense. We're just here to save the world, and we're getting one step closer to doing so. So with that, thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Bye, world!